Well, well, hey guys, this is Alex with I Chongqing. What brings me here? Chongqing's railway station. If you're an international audience, I'm gonna have to tell you guys about a few things here. The Spring Festival, the start of the Spring Festival that started on the 17th of January here. This is China's largest and the world's largest migration of people. Hundreds of millions of people. Pretty much the whole country goes on holidays. So let's take Thanksgiving, Christmas Day, New Year's Day, and roll it into one holiday. That's about the size of this holiday. And that's what it means to the Chinese. They go back to visit their family everywhere. Friends meet up with friends. It's pretty much a countrywide holiday. I'm gonna give some statistics to you guys that are gonna blow your mind here on how incredible a train station like this in one of China's largest cities, this is Chongqing, how does one of the biggest cities in China get all its people home? Maybe we take an airplane, maybe we take the cars. Wow, this is one of the largest rail grids in the world. You can get a train. Pay attention because we're gonna be rolling through some cities you probably haven't heard of, but they're definitely bigger than the size of Los Angeles, New York, Paris, London, Madrid, you name it. Here we go. If I wanna take a one hour and 18 minute train ride, I'm gonna roll into Chengdu. Population, 20.8 million. Wow. Chengdu, home of the Panta. Hello everybody in Chengdu there. Another province, Shanxi province, to that wonderful, beautiful city of Xi'an. That's gonna take me five hours, 13 million people, and you wanna know the price to go there. Ready for it? Five and a half hour bullet train ride to an amazing city of Xi'an, 400 RMB. Wuhan, 270 RMB to go to Wuhan. That's in a completely other province of Hubei province, Changsha. Another city of 10 million people. Chengdu, 20 million. Xi'an, 13 million. Wuhan, 12.4 million. Changsha, 10 million. Kunming, 8.46 million. Well, I was told one of the most beautiful cities in China. All of this is possible with the investment of what China has done, the Chongqing Rail Station and the fantastic high-speed rail network that we have here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna walk into this beautiful building behind us here, and we're gonna kinda see how you get to see your friends, or how do you get to see your families in record times, on record trains, going across this country at speeds reaching 360 kilometer an hour. Fantastic, let's go. Okay guys, we're still in a world pandemic here. Of course, China has a zero COVID policy. Mask is a requirement. Here is how they set out the safest way in the world's largest migration. Everybody's going in, everyone has their health code. About the, the health code, this is a live application. This isn't just some application put on your phone to look pretty. This is serious business here in China. Here's my health code. Here's a individual here that's checking it from the health authorities, we'll call it, the health department. This contact tracing app is very important to everyone. People show their identity cards to get on the train and it's pretty much a paperless uh, system here. This is security. They're coming up there. Okay, thank you, thank you. Wow, that wasn't so bad getting inside the train station here. Let's have a look at everybody. This is amazing, but you can see a lot of people I have not been to a train station in my country that had so much seats as this. There's a little map of the train station. And these are the coin operated machines. Just kidding. No, these are the ticket machines. If you guys want a lesson on how to pronounce cities, I've got a little bit of a hint for you here, guys. Come over to one of these intercom speakers. There's the speaker there. Wow, what a way to travel, guys. I mean, seriously. Wouldn't you like to have the world's largest bullet train and world largest rail network? Ah, boy, oh boy, is New Year's going to be a great time here in China. Let's go out and have a look at some of the trains, okay? Now, guys, don't laugh at me when I say, wow, it's sure nice to take a an escalator down to the railway tracks. Now, you might think that I'm being sarcastic, but actually, not. In China here, the infrastructure is pretty much, we'll call it door to door or end to end. A very clean station, immaculate and spotless. Look at how beautiful that is. There's some trains heading off to other destinations in the distance there. This is how it's done. And guys, this is pretty much when I hand this video over to Aiko at Ai Chongqing, who's going to help us out uh, by explaining to you in precision detail and probably even getting on a train. Guys, thanks for watching.
车往惠阳北方向旅客，请您抓紧时间到十六 A 五、十七 A 五检票口、十六 B、十七 B 检票口检票上车。Thank、you